Hi and welcome to Category 9 of Mini Program Challenges. In this category, you are going to solve nine different mini programs or challenges in the department of Python sets. So, what do we have here? First, uh, you can see the, um, now you can see the timestamp for this video and for this category. I'm going to give you five seconds to just go ahead and take a look at it. So first off, we are going to dive into the very first question. It says add a list of elements to a given set. So we have a sample set and we have a sample list. We need to add the list to the set. So go ahead, pause the video and you're going to see my solution after three seconds. So what I'm going what I'm going to do is first, I'm going to copy both of the list and sets. And then I'm going to say, uh, let's grab the sample, sample set. And I'm going to say dot update. And then I'm going to pass in the sample list. There we go. That's it. That's the only thing we needed to do here. So let's take a look at the sample set. Sample set. I'm going to save it and I'm going to run that. We have black, green, orange, yellow, blue, and red. So that's it for question one. Now, these questions for sets, they're going to be very, very, very simple. And we should be able to complete this category in no time. Very simple questions. Yet, they are very, very essential exercises that you need to do to be able to master the set operations and set methods. The second question says, run a new, um, re sorry, return a new set of identical items from the given two sets. So pause the video. Uh, you're going to see my solution after three seconds. First things first, I'm going to copy both of these sets. I'm going to put them there and I'm going to say print. Let's grab set one and I'm going to say dot intersection and I'm going to pass in set two. Let's save that and there we go. It says 40. 50 and 30 they are available in both set 1 and set 2 they are in other words the identical uh, items moving on to question number three question number three says return a new set with all the items uh, from both sets by removing duplicates so go ahead attempt the challenge you're going to see my solution next I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to copy both of these sets. I'm going to put them there. Now, what is the set operation that we need to grab is uh, we're going to grab the set union. I could just create a third set variable and I could say set set underscore one dot uh, union. And I'm going to pass in set two. I'm going to save that. I'm going to print set three in case you want to store that inside a variable. So we have 70, 40, 10, 50, 20, 60, and 30. So we don't have uh, any duplicates. Like 30, 40, 50, they were duplicates, but we don't have those duplicates in here. We, don't, we do have 30, 40, 50, but they're not like multiple of them. That's it for question number three. Moving on to question number four. Given two sets, update the first set with items that exist only the first set and not in the second set. Go ahead, attempt the challenge. You're going to see my solution after three seconds. Now, I'm going to copy these two sets to the solution file. And in here, I'm going to say uh, set underscore three is going to be equal to set underscore one dot difference update. And I'm going to pass in set two. Now let's print set three and let's take a look at it. So for set three, we have none. Uh, it says given two sets, update the first set with the items of 
update the first set okay we, sh we should be we should update it not like create a new set so i'm just gonna say set let's take a look at set one and now it says update the first set with the items that, that exist only in the first set and not in the second set so in the second set we have 20 uh, and um, we don't uh, that do not exist in the second set so the items that do not exist in the second set there are 10 and 30 because 20 it does exist in the second set we don't update it with that that's it for question number four moving on to question number five it says return item 10 20 30 from the following set at once so go ahead pause the video you're going to see my solution after three seconds now i'm gonna grab the set put it right here and i'm gonna say set and i'm gonna say set dot difference update difference update and I'm going to pass in 10, 20, and 30. There we go. And I'm going to print the set itself. There we go. And we got 50 and 40. There we go. Very cool. That's it for question number five. Should remove this one as well. Let's move on to question number six. It says, return a set of all the, all of the, return a set of all the unique elements in sets A and B b we need to return you need to return the all the unique elements so go ahead pause the video you're going to see my solution after three seconds i'm going to copy both of the sets put it to the in the solution and i'm just going to print the value so i'm going to say set underscore one dot symmetric difference uh, and i'm going to pass in set two let's save that let's go ahead and run it there we go this is the symmetric difference that's it for question number six moving on to question number seven very simple right it says check if two sets have any elements in common if yes display the common elements go ahead pause the video and you're going to see my solution in three seconds now how was the challenge i'm sure you did great so i'm going to say if set one dot is disjoint set two if this is the case i'm going to say print two sets this um the two sets have no common elements and elements If this is not the case, I'm going to say uh, common elements print uh, common elements are. Why do I keep uh, mistyping mistyp that? So common elements are set one one dot intersection set two that's it so let's go ahead and let's save that so the common elements are 10 so we have 10 here and there the only common element is actually 10 we don't have any other common element now i'm going to move on to question number eight in question number eight it says update set one by adding items from set two except common items uh, go ahead pause the video and you're going to see my solution in three seconds now we have set one and we have set two i'm going to say set underscore one dot symmetric difference update and i'm going to pass in set two the only thing we need to do is we need to uh, uh, print or print to the screen set one and that's it so set one uh, we have we had 10 20 30 and uh, uh, in set one we had 10 20 30 40 and 50 the question said that we need to update set one um, by adding items from set two except the um, the uh, identical or except the common items so the common items were um, 
40 and 50 we didn't provide 40 and 50 we just updated that with uh, 30 40 50 sorry so we have 10 and 20 from our uh, set a and we have 70 and 60 from set 2 so we have updated that without the duplicate elements and the final question says remove items from set 1 that are not common to both set 1 and set 2 if they're not common we need to remove them from set 1 keep that in mind so go ahead pause the video you're going to see my solution in three seconds i'm going to copy these two sets first and then i'm going to say set one dot intersection update intersection update set two there we go that's it so we need to remove them from set one that's why i'm just going to print out set one there we go we got we we have 40 50 and 30. so with this our eight our ninth category category nine questions about sets they come to an end see you in the next category